a herpes cure, a vaccine? I've been getting lots of questions about this, so stick around and I'll tell you everything you need to know. Hi guys, I'm Dr. Lane from Adelaide, South Australia, bringing you fun and factual health education. Now, if you haven't seen my first video on genital herpes, you should check it out. I'm putting a link on the screen right now. So, is it true? Have scientists discovered a cure for herpes? The answer, it's complicated. So let me start by explaining what a cure would look like. When the herpes virus gets into your system, it essentially can do two things. The first is it lays dormant. In other words, it causes no symptoms, but it literally just hides in your body, more specifically in certain nerve cells in your body. The second thing it can do is cause an acute outbreak, which is when you get the classic symptoms of vesicles and ulcers. To cure herpes, we would have to find a way to eradicate the virus completely from your body. In other words, get into the nerve cells where it's lying dormant and destroy it once and for all. Now, if we could do that, you wouldn't be getting any more outbreaks because you would only get the outbreaks if the virus is in your body in the first place. The problem is that not only are viruses very good at surviving when they lay dormant in places like nerve cells, they can be particularly hard to get to. So any cure that involves some form of medication, for example, would not only have to be able to kill the virus, but also find it. Now currently, there is no known cure for herpes infection in humans, but research suggests that a future cure for herpes in humans could certainly be on the horizon. A group of scientists have actually been exploring the role of gene therapy in targeting latent HSV infection. In other words, destroying the herpes virus that lurks in the nerve cells. After many years of research, the team published a paper in August 2020 revealing that they had successfully destroyed up to 95% of herpes virus that was living dormant in the nerve cells of mice. The way that they did this was using a type of DNA cutting gene therapy, which works exactly like a pair of scissors. It targets the herpes virus and cuts it into pieces. So essentially it can no longer repair itself and then it dies. Now this research has been headed by Dr. Keith Jerome, who is a world renowned virologist working at the Fred Hutch Cancer Center in Seattle. Now these guys are doing some amazing research. So if you want to follow their channel on YouTube, I'm putting the link in the description below. All right, so if a cure is potentially on the horizon, when would it be available for humans? Now, obviously, while it's very encouraging that the therapy seems to be working in mice, it still needs to be carefully assessed for safety before it can be tried in humans. However, it does sound like clinical trials could be happening within the next three years. So that's a herpes cure. What about a vaccine? BioNTech are currently trialing a vaccination for HSV in humans. It's still in early stages, so there is no time frame on how long it will be before we may see it available. But my understanding from early trials is that the vaccination has been well tolerated by humans. They're still trying to determine how effective it is, however, against HSV prevention. Now, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so and hit yes to notifications so that you can see all my new content. Stay healthy guys, I'll be seeing you soon.